I'm Chrissy. And I'm Catherine. And we are traveling gleefully. We are here in Phnom Penh by the Tonle Sap River. About to walk down um, the promenade here. Very, I say, well, I was gonna say it's a very warm day, but actually, there's a cool breeze yeah, that's quite nice. nice. Um, we got in yesterday afternoon, um, didn't film too much, but I'll pop in what we did film here. We have just arrived in Cambodia, we're in a cab on the way to the hotel, traffic is terrible, and our cab driver <laughs> has just left to go to the bathroom in the middle of the road. The <laughs> just like, well, no, we're on the side of the yeah, road, he put his hazard put on, his hazard to be lights fair. on, so we're basically parked. Um, and he's just run to the bathroom. <laughs> Look, would you need to go? Also, like traffic is terrible. We were meant to be there like 15 minutes ago, and it's just been been very busy. Yeah. But you know what? Welcome to Cambodia. It's hectic. We just went out for our first Cambodian meal, and then on our way back, this like 10 year old <laughs> helped us cross the street because we were like. We know you can't wait for cars to pass you, but we're also too afraid to just like stop them. So we just waited and then he just came across and like stopped the traffic for us. So that was kind of him. And now we know a little bit better how to do it. Yeah, so but it doesn't make do it, it ourselves. It doesn't make it less terrifying because we've had like 27 years of like, hey, don't run in front of traffic. <laughs> yeah. And now you're just supposed to do it. But that's okay. We'll figure it out. It's fun. It's really cool. It's really lively at night. Yeah, like walking there's... past the park and there are people like dancing and playing music and playing soccer and yeah, you know people very... out and about having dinner. It's very cool. Very alive. Morning. It's our first morning in Phnom Penh. Um, we look ridiculous. We were we were told by our doctor that the only way to like really make sure you don't get any mosquito borne diseases is to not be bitten by mosquitoes um, and she recommended long pants and long flowy shirts to make sure we don't get bitten we'll see how ridiculous it is if tomorrow we decide that it was too much we'll turn it down yeah because like but. every other tourist is just wearing shorts and t-shirts and we're like i look like a doctor in a lab coat and <laughs> we have like long socks her <laughs> ankles aren't exposed and i just don't know if we're overkill and we look stupid or if it's the right thing to do but but no it's very nice we'll we'll wander down and see what we find looks like yeah. there's some markets on behind us so it's cute we've walked down to the royal palace which you can see part off behind us um unfortunately it's closed at the moment for some renovations um but it is beautiful. beautiful it's like gold plated no, I can't zoom in, but it's absolutely stunning. And it's so busy, look. It's so busy, there's like lots of people around, picnicking, playing, selling stuff. It's fun. Beautiful. We're in the central market in um, Phnom Penh. It's just under this giant dome. It's very cool. I read online that everything was like for tourists and very overpriced so we're not going to buy anything but we are enjoying the atmosphere and the market and so much jewelry and i look at so many beautiful things bucketing so we are instead walking back to our hotel and we will eat lunch there and then venture out again later in the day when it's a bit drier I think hopefully Yeah. <laughs> 
nice. It's very like touristy. Um, I got crunch toast for the six dollars. We got bacon eggs for five. We got fruit smoothies for the seven. afternoon of our second full day in Phnom Penh. We had a um, very lazy middle of the day, went back to our hotel, had a snack, just relaxed. Just researching like what Siem Reap and... Yeah, trying to figure out what we're doing in Siem Reap once we arrive there tomorrow. Yeah, where to have dinner tonight, how to get to the bus stop, just like general travel. Travel admin, yeah. basically. <laughs> Um, but now we're walking up to the National Museum of Cambodia, which we went to yesterday, but we didn't go in. We just went to the grounds, um, but we've decided that we would like to go in and have a look around. Um, so we're wandering up there and then we'll probably just hang around until dinner time um, in a few hours. We found a nice um, Cambodian restaurant to go to um, tonight, so we'll show you that. And then tomorrow we're off to Siem Reap. We just finished up in the museum and it was very cool. There's a lot of stuff in there um, from like kind of prehistoric things right through to a couple of hundred years ago um, from like Cambodian history. We couldn't, we weren't allowed to take photos or videos in there, but it was, it was pretty cool. It was only 10 US dollars each to enter, um, which I think was worth it. Yeah, it was cool. A good, a good use of our afternoon. And also the building is beautiful. I did mm. get some clips of that, which I'll put in. Um, but yeah, it was very nice. It was nice seeing some Cambodian culture and history. Yeah. We also forgot to update yesterday, but um, we've noticed that tourists are wearing short sleeves and like shorts, but all of the locals wear long pants and long sleeves. So we decided to stick with our long sleeves. I've um, seen a lot of tourists wearing long sleeves though. Yeah, and it is, um, we have seen like a few mosquitoes around and stuff, mm. so probably best to better to be safe better be safe stopped at a beautiful rest stop. Look at that. It's just a beautiful um, lunch spot on the water, but neither of us are eating because we're not feeling super well. I think we've just eaten something that our bodies didn't agree with, so we're just taking it easy, just having some water, maybe some plain food, but um, it's absolutely beautiful and we should be in Siem Reap in about two and a half hours, so yeah, excited to explore somewhere new. Hello, it is editing Chrissy from the future, from that video. Um, we've actually decided that we're going to split our Cambodia vlog into two. So we've got the Phnom Penh one, um, which will wrap up here, and then the next one will be Siem Reap, um, which will be a, a longer one that we'll post a bit sooner. Um, but we didn't decide to do that until after, which is why there's no logical end to this video. Um, but yeah, this one will wrap up here and then there'll be another one with the second half of our Cambodia trip coming soon. Mm -hmm. 
Thanks for watching. Bye.